If you believe the micro smokerizer monitor is reading incorrectly, you can perform a quick check test to make sure that the sensor hasn't drifted out of specification. You will need 20 ppm CO in air calibration gas to perform the check. Attach the gas canister to the regulator. Be sure to screw the canister into the regulator. Attach the other end of the regulator to the monitor. On your micro, press the breath test symbol on screen. When prompted by the exhale symbol, open the regulator and allow the gas to flow at 1 litre per minute. Allow the gas to flow through the instrument for the duration of the test. The reading will rise and stabilise on screen. After the test is finished, close the regulator and remove the gas. If the result is between 18 and 22 ppm, then you need do nothing else. If the reading is less than 18 ppm or higher than 22 ppm, your sensor has drifted out of specification. To remedy this, you will need to perform a calibration. The micro smokerizer does not need regular calibration. However, if it did not successfully pass the bump test, the sensor may have drifted out of specification. This can happen due to a number of things, such as using products containing alcohol on the monitor, but you may need to perform a calibration to rectify this. Turn on the monitor by pressing the power button once. Press the settings icon followed by the calibration icon five times to unlock calibration. Then, the calibration icon once to proceed. If the temperature of the monitor is too low to calibrate, the blue thermometer will be shown. Try again later once the unit has warmed up. If the temperature of the monitor is too high to calibrate, the red thermometer will be shown. Try again later once the unit has cooled down. Once this has been successfully carried out, the device will perform a zero. Do not apply gas at this stage. The first step of the calibration process will be shown on screen. Follow the on-screen instructions to finish the calibration process. Gas flow should be set to 1 litre per minute. A successful calibration will be indicated by a green tick. Press the home icon to return to the home screen. A failed calibration will be indicated by a red cross. Press the retry icon to reattempt calibration. If the problem persists, see troubleshooting or call your local supplier of Bedfont products. Once the calibration is complete, press the home icon to return to the home screen. <music>